we have such time restraints that we take advantage of every extra minute that we have. I, I know I met some of you, and um, my name is Dean Taba, and I'm the director of the, the jazz program at PMI. Um, I'll just tell you a little bit about what the week was like. We had uh, four instructors, including myself. Um, um, the, what I would consider the, the, the core instructors were Abe Lavinus. This is Abe Lavinus from Los Angeles, local boy, grew up in Waipahu, uh, now lives in Los Angeles, and Steve Tressler, who's on his way. And Steve's a highly acclaimed jazz educator from Seattle. And, a, and an old friend of, well, actually, Abe Dean, you've been in Boston. Yeah, too. with, with Randy, we were, we're all in the same time. President of the Symphony Road, but that's how I met Steve. Wonderful, wonderful musician and educator. And also, we had another local musician who lived in New York for actually, I think, 40 years. Just moved back, Alan Wong, is a saxophonist and woodwind artist. And he just moved back to Hawaii. Hey, Steve, I'm just introducing everybody. All right. Yeah. I, I, I should have I warned you a funny thing about, like, I think local music families, everybody's early. <laughs> yeah. They said it like, like when I do the ukulele festival every year, I show up ready to play at the time designated, and everybody's just looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe you said they had one. Well, maybe you said the door was unlocked before. Exactly. <laughs> anyway, this is Steve Tressler. Yeah. And um, some of the things that, well, what we're going to do today is we're going to, the, the group's going to perform three pieces for you. And, um, what we did this week, obviously, we did more than just these three pieces, but I think this is kind of a good cross-section, a good demonstration of what, what was happening. But um, uh, Steve and Abe were in either one of the two groups um, all day, and I was bouncing back and forth. So really, they had three three of us uh, uh, at any point you know, during, during the week, and Alan Wan came in a few times. And did, did you folks hear at all about the jam session that we had on Thursday? Maybe, hopefully, not, not everybody was able to make it. But we had a lot of fun doing that. Um, but you know, this program, it's really, and I told Steve and Abe before we started, the, the goal is, is to help the students learn how to teach themselves, essentially, and how to assess what they're doing, and, and how to practice, how to practice jazz, how to listen to jazz, how to learn from watching a videotape of your own performance. And they, I think they all did really well, and I think they, they all achieved a lot of those goals, and, and I'm really happy about that. Um, before we start playing, I would be remiss if I didn't mention, because a few parents have asked, but U Symphony does have a year-round jazz program. I think I'm going to change the name to Contemporary Ensemble, because we do brutal Mars tunes and work with Ratatea Helm, and, we're going to work with Amy Hanai, Lee Gilliam, and Shari Lin. And it could be, it's, it's basically just not orchestral music. And it's rhythm section oriented with wind instruments. But we have a year-round program, so if you have any questions about that, please email me or contact me. We're always looking for, for students. We have an advanced, an intermediate, and a beginning level class. So there's a place for everybody. Um, so I'm going to stop talking because I said I was going to make it brief and I went on way too long. And I'm going to introduce you to, that's Abe Agrimus and Steve Tressler. And we'll do our three pieces. And thank you for providing your students this opportunity. We had a lot of fun working with them. You got it, Steve. All right. All right. Thank you, everyone. It's an honor to be out here from Seattle working with the soft musicians this week. For the start off our first set, this will be Equinox by the great John Colton. We've got a special guest on bass guitar. This <laughs> flew in. Even play with a top, yeah, top call bass player.
so we can all improvise together without it turning into complete chaos right away. So there's actually 1,500 different signs and they're multidisciplinary for visual artists and actors and dancers. And during the pandemic, I was playing with a group of artists all over the world. We had a clarinet player in Turkey and a visual artist and actor in Argentina, violin player in Belgium, dancer in Austin. We, produced, we did a bunch of things live over Zoom and recorded our parts and video edited, all this, all this kind of stuff. But it also works yeah, ensembles all over the world to do this, but it's also a great icebreaker for some folks that might be newer at, at improvising or at all levels, really, to come up with something, come up with something on the fly. Um, yeah. Now for something completely different. <laughs> Gonna get a little bit, a little bit funky after being a little bit abstract. So this is from the great keyboardist. Uh, Joe's out on mercy, mercy, mercy. Here we go. Rhythm section. Break the Here we go. One, two, one, two, three. Thank you. 